plenty of relief after missing 17 year old Kayla Durler was found safe Saturday afternoon in downtown. A local organization, Jamie's Dream Team, organizing a search party and one of those volunteers was who spotted her. I would say I was just very, very joyous, very thankful, very appreciative and appreciative of, of, of the police and all they did to look for her and to help organize and coordinate with Jamie's Dream Team so that we were able to be community. Kayla Durler missing since Friday morning. She was dropped off at Stowe Rocks High School, but school was closed due to a utilities emergency. Kayla getting onto a PRT bus headed downtown. She was last seen about three hours later getting off at Stanwick Street. That was the last sighting of Kayla until she was found by Rebecca Bykoski. Bykoski was part of a search team organized by Jamie's Dream Team, a charity organization whose mission is to grant dreams to those who are handicapped, disabled, terminally ill, or suffering from a condition or disease. Why wouldn't have we organized a search team is the question. This, that little girl needed to be found, and she needed to be found quick. The organization began their search Saturday morning, passing out flyers and talking to community members. Jamie says close to 150 volunteers were out searching. And let me tell you something, the volunteers that come out, the people, this community is so wonderful. They were unbelievable. They were coming out in carloads. People just, how can I help? What can I do? They were unbelievable. Parkway Center Mall, they opened up there. They opened up to us as a warming shelter and as in a as a hub to start to pass out flyers. Everybody was so unbelievable. They say the search ranged throughout the entire city, starting in downtown and going through Oakland, Stowe Township and West Mifflin. Almost five hours into the search, Kayla was spotted in front of a store downtown safe and even telling police and volunteers she wasn't scared. She was safe. She was clean and she wasn't scared. Um, and I feel like that's what's most important is that she got back. Police say Kayla was taken to a local hospital Friday night for an evaluation, although they do say she appears to be fine. Reporting in downtown, Yasmin Rodriguez, Pittsburgh Action News 4. Making their dreams come true. At Jamie's Dream Team, it's the next dream that is our most important one. It only happens because of great people like you. Help us make their dreams come true by donating or volunteering at jamiesdreamteam.org.